Today, we're going to discuss how to automate your crafting XP farm in Starfield. Now, we've got a lot of info to cover and no time to waste, so let's get to it. Ladies and gentlemen, by far the fastest way to level your character in Starfield is by utilizing a crafting XP farm. However, this method requires a lot of fast clicking. You will be repeatedly smashing the E button on your keyboard and hitting that left click on your mouse. Needless to say, this is hard on the old digits, and to be honest, it can be rather annoying. So today, I will show you how to automate this process and set things up to spam craft with the press of a single button. We will achieve this goal with the use of a simple macro. Now to start, we need to download and install a program to create and run said macro. I will be using the program Auto Hotkey, which is completely free and relatively user friendly. So head to autohotkey.com, download and install the program. Once Auto Hotkey is installed, run the program and click New Script, which will bring up this menu right here. Be sure to title your new macro and also take note of where your new script will be saved. We will need to access this later. Next, click edit. This will bring up a blank notepad document where we will write our script. Next, simply type the code you see on the screen exactly as written. Now your macro variables will need to be adjusted depending on your PC specs. As you can see, I'm showing three different macros with different variables. On the left, we have the code for a low-end PC. So you'll want to use this macro if your PC is a potato. In the middle, we have our mid-tier option. This is the one that I use personally. Now, if your PC is a beast, you can use the macro on the right. This is the high-end option. Once you have your chosen macro script written exactly as depicted, click Click File and select Save. Now I would recommend creating all three. That way you can test each one in game and see which speed works best for your setup. Now we are all set to automate the crafting experience process. Be sure Auto Hotkey is running and open up the folder where your scripts are saved. Now double click on the macro you want to try. Then start up Starfield, load up your save, and head to your industrial workbench. I'm using the adaptive frames method, so we're going to click on the adaptive frames. This brings up the quantity menu. Move your cursor to here and click to maximize the quantity. Now simply hit the F11 key, sit back and enjoy the show. The macro will do all the work for you, saving you from having to spam that E button and left click on your mouse. Once you run out of resources, press F11 to stop the macro, travel to Venus, sleep to pass some time, head back to your outpost, and get back to crafting. Now you may run into a couple of issues while utilizing this method. First, there is a known bug with crafting stations at outposts. When you travel back to your outpost, you may receive this message when you attempt to use your industrial workbench. It says you cannot use this. It is obstructed. There is a simple fix to this bug. All you have to do is drop down a quick save and immediately load that save. This should allow you to access and utilize your industrial workbench. The second issue you may run into has to do with the macro itself. Occasionally, the automated e-press will happen before for the second left click, which maximizes the crafting quantity. So instead of crafting 99 adaptive frames, you will only craft one. If this happens, simply press F11 to stop the macro, left click twice to access the adaptive frames and maximize the quantity, and then press F11 to restart the macro. I would also recommend minimizing the amount of programs you have running in the background. This 
will help to mitigate the macro missteps and allow your macro to run smoothly. By following the steps outlined in this guide, you can completely automate your crafting XP farm, allowing you to mass craft items in Starfield without having to manually spam the buttons. Now, if you found this guide helpful and or enjoyable, be sure to subscribe to the channel for more Starfield guides. Speaking of which, if you need help setting up your experience farm, I've created a guide to walk you through that process step by step. Simply click that box in the top right corner of the screen. But for now, this is Savin saying thank you, ladies and gentlemen, and I'll catch you in the next one.